In this presentation, we look at how to solve a system of linear equations using the R command solve. So consider the following system of linear equations. The solution of the system of, equa of equations are the unique solutions for x1, x2 and x3 that are valid for all of these three equations here. So what we're going to do is set this up as a system of matrices. So A corresponds to the coefficients from the previous slide. For example, this would be 1, 1 and 2. The coefficients of this equation are 2, 1 and 3. And here we have 1, minus 2 and 5. And there we have them there. Now we actually write out the that the the vector of a known value is x. So this vector here uh, is a vector x and it comprises x1, x2, x3 as a column vector. We also have the solution vector over here 2, 5 and 11. Now we can actually consider these as matrices. We could consider that as a matrix and consider that as a matrix. And we're going to use those matrices in R in R. So I have R open now, and I'm going to ent uh, have A. I have A set up already. A. I have B set up. Small b. Now to solve the system of linear equations, we're going to use these two matrices. And how we do it, as I said before, is we're going to use the com command solve. First, we specify the coefficient matrix A, and then we specify the solution vector uh, B and this gives us our values for x1, x2 and x3. So from the R output we see that x1 is 2, x2 is minus 2 and x3 is equal to 1. Before we go, an uh, important remark actually, the R command solve can also be used to determine the inverse of a matrix A. All we have to do is specify the matrix A without any additional arguments. For example, essentially just A in its own, not A and B. So here we have A again, and to get the inverse of A, there we go. So that concludes our presentation.